Can you talk a, a little bit about um, that role of maintaining authenticity in, in your own life and, and the particular challenges that, that women may face in feeling comfortable in doing that? If your authentic self is so out there at Six Sigma that you know, people sort of say, who is she? She's authentic, but she's completely out of the mold. That's going to be tough, Maya, because we have to be practical about these things. What I'm talking about is I'm not going to remake myself to look like Mara Forbes. I'm just not going to because that's trying to be somebody I'm not. Okay. At the same time, I don't have to become this golfing, fishing, uh, you know, going off for a weekend with the boys kind of a person. That's just not me. I have a family. I love being with my family. I am who I am. And I like to work a certain way. <clears throat> and I've distinguished myself through my brand of authenticity. I am not going to remake this brand of authenticity to be different because if I did that, I'm not authentic. Second is that it's more effort to keep up a new image than to be authentic. Because you will slip up. When you're trying to create an image for yourself, you will slip up. In my case, what you see is what you get. 